Can you hold? Rock and feel. I'm a crazy loudest person that you ever seen. You can now feeling free, but everything you gotta be caring for. videos so much man yeah so to bring in uh, Vatang here you know an absolute og in the beatboxing like this guy's been around oh my god like ever since i started watching and even earlier before that like late 20 uh not even 2010s like earlier than that in the late 2000s like 2009 era i think is like the first time i seen this guy um from russia and yeah so he's actually he's been away for a little while but he kind of came back recently in the last couple of years um, you know, made some wild cards for GBB 23, uh, competed in the cruise category. I'm pretty sure if I remember correctly. Um, but yeah, so Terrace, you know, we seen what he does with those videos, um, to an extension, we saw what Improver has been doing, uh, and now Terrace kind of getting Vatang into it, who offers like a completely different kind of skill set when it comes to solo beatbox. Like Vatang has a very good natural singing voice. Um, also very unique powerful bass lines as well um i always describe it like i haven't reacted to batang much because simply because he hasn't been around for uh quite a while he's only kind of been like like i said coming back into the scene as of recently so like when i started to react to stuff he hasn't been around at all um but like before then um he'd always had like this kind of like i would i described it as like a like a like a like a rock metal kind of style, like in terms of his, like the textures of, of his bass lines and like the raspiness of his voice, like the way he delivers his vocals is very um, rock-esque, if that makes sense, like the genre of music, right? And yeah, that was obviously on full display here, but you know, adding again, with the way that Terrace has been kind of making his music, um, adding that layer of effects over his, his vocals, his beatboxing, um, just amplifies his kind of like distinctive kind of style very very well and i don't know i'm pretty sure this is probably a cover of something i don't know i don't know if that's original i don't recognize the track at all 
but it doesn't really matter to me because the way that he performed it, the way he delivered it, and you know the kind of skill set that Vatang has as a solo beatboxer, you know, really amplified the track overall as a whole. And yeah, other than that, like the production of it, you know, the video side of it, really uh, entertaining to watch as well. But yeah, ah, oh, that that's super sick. I, I'm really liking this kind of trend that we're seeing online for for beatbox content because I do truly feel like it's a good positive thing um some like diehard fans might not be the biggest fan of it um i've seen definitely seen some criticism of this kind of content in the beatbox scene but i think like it really brings in like a new audience right um that goes with that saying because i feel like beatbox raw beatbox uh, is kind of still pretty niche and i think it will always remain in in that kind of category so you kind of need stuff like this to kind of push it to the mainstream audience right and i think you know what Terrace has been doing is really kind of pushing that boundary I think so all right that's a super sick video I really enjoyed that one every time I see these every time it gets recommended to me um I always look forward to it so much because it's so entertaining to listen to and yeah it's just I love the kind of progression that um the beatbox scene has been going online so all right, if you guys enjoyed what you heard here, links in the description to the original video. Go check it out. Go uh, check out Vatang as well. Links in the description to his channel. Um, you want to support me, though, leave a like on this video. You can sub to my channel. Check out my Discord channel as well. Links in the description to that. And other than that, I'll see you guys in the next Beatbox Reaction video.